He was a painter. He was a sculptor. He was the Orange Ninja Turtle. That's right, everyone. Today we are going to discuss Michelangelo. For those of you who haven't had a chance to study his work yet, Michelangelo is famous for painting the Sistine Chapel in Rome, sculpting the marble statue of David, and, of course, working to bring down the shredder with his mad nunchuck skills while eating copious amounts of pizza. Now, you may ask, why are we talking about Michelangelo when we should be talking about Newbery winners? Good question! Well, it turns out that the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York City has just bought a statue of an angel that they think may have been done by Michelangelo. But, unfortunately, there aren't enough clues for experts to decide if it was actually done by Michelangelo, one of his students, or somebody just trying to copy him. Fortunately, for the art world, Claudia and Jamie Kincaid are on this case. This brother and sister pair have just run away from home to go and live in the Metropolitan Museum for a while, and they soon find themselves absorbed in this great art mystery. But Claudia and Jamie better hurry up and find the answer soon. Their money is just about out, and every day that they stay in the museum is just one day closer to them being caught and being sent home, and the answer to this great mystery being lost forever. So, to find out who really sculpted the angel and read more about Claudia and Jamie's adventures living in one of the greatest art museums in America, check out the 1968 Newbery Award winner from the Mixed Up Files of Mrs. Basil E. Frankweiler by E. L. Konigsberg. Or, if you're looking for some more great art mysteries, try Chasing Vermeer by Blue Balliet or uh, Masterpiece by Elise Broach. And for one that starts out in our very own Minneapolis Institute of Art, uh, try The Mystery of the Third Lucretia by Susan Runholt.